everyone, it's CC, and uh, I'm going to show you what my Sephora basket looks like at this point, right before the sale is starting. Um, I'm figuring my budget to be right around the $200 area, so maybe $240 in product or something like that. Um, when I, you know, whittle this down, currently it's at 26 items and $744. So we know that I won't be buying this, but these are kind of things that I am eyeing. And although I made rouge this year, I have not, a lot of it's been skincare or small purchases um, in general. I have not really, there hasn't been a whole lot of things that I've been super excited about this year. And somehow I still made rouge. So there we go with that. Um, but I did want to go through my list and kind of talk about it. Maybe remove things. Maybe wait to remove things. But, you know, just kind of talk about it and uh, see where I am right now. The first thing on this um, is the Hourglass Confession Refillable Lipstick Set. And there are three colors um, of the lipstick in there and two of the packaging that you put the refills in. And that is $60. So I don't really think that's that bad of a deal, especially for something that is um, in the higher end of, um, you know, a brand. The next thing I've heard some great things about, and there are six of these Baggage Claim Rose Gold Eye Masks in this for $25. So I'm kind of interested in those, um, and there we go with that. One thing that I've been going back and forth on is this Gingerbread Spice Eyeshadow Palette from Too Faced. Um, here's the thing about Too Faced. I love their mattes, and I love their shimmers. I hate those shadows that they put the glitter in the mattes. Um, they do not work for me, and they're usually really pretty colors that they do that with, too. And then the next, we have the Huda Beauty Obsessions Eyeshadow Palette in the Precious Stones in both Ruby and Amethyst. I'm very interested in these, and I know they're um, limited edition, so it kind of makes me want to get them um, a little bit more. Um, I wasn't interested in the other colors, but these two I really still am. Um, I have said when we looked at my loves list that I didn't want a mask, but this one was really interesting me. Um, maybe it's something I'll wait and get in the spring, or maybe I'll pick it up now. I'm not really sure, but I do have a lot of masks that I kind of need to get through um, currently, so I hate to buy something and not use it right away. But this really did interest me. It's from Pharmacy, the Bright On Massage Activated Vitamin C Mask with Enchinina, Echinina, oh, I could just, I, yeah, Green Envy. <laughs> it's a $38 mask, and uh, that really interests me. One thing that I almost always pick up at these sales is a first aid beauty kit. Um, I am completely out of my first aid beauty moisturizer this has i think a new cleanser the oatmeal mask the radiance pads and a serum so that really interests me um i haven't taken this out but i probably will the charlotte tilbury matte revolution lipstick and pillow talk i don't know much about this formula the color has always interested me but one of the reviews i saw said that it turns brown on them which is a problem for me um, with a lot of lipsticks or even orange. So I don't know. I don't know that I want that. Um, next is the Natasha Denona Mini Blush and Glow. I think this is a great value, but I don't know. That's, that's the reason it's in here is because it's such a great value, and especially with the discount. Um, if I were to get a Charlotte Tilbury product, I was thinking about this kit um, because you have a shadow stick, a um, coal eyeliner, a mascara, a pillow talk lipstick, and a pillow talk lip cheat liner. So kind of something I was thinking about. Um, I think I put this in here just in case I needed something small. 
<laughs> I don't know. But it's a Sephora Collection double-ended shadow and crease brush. Something I'm really interested in. Um, I don't know, though. You know, I just don't know. And the Charlotte Tilbury Lip Sheet Liner in Pillow Talk. Um, here's something I'm definitely getting. Either four or five or six of them. The Josie Moran Soul Sisters Pure Argon Hydration Duo. Something I really need. Um, I'm running out of my regular argon oil. And this has both a half an ounce of the argon oil and a half an ounce of the argon oil light. Those minis retail for $16 normally. They're $19 in this little set. And this is kind of the way I stock up on them. I have found that um, there are deals on QVC with larger size jars. Um, but this is actually the best deal. You get the best price um, buying it this way. Another mask I'm interested in, but uh, I don't know. May not buy it now. Dr. Robux Tama Healing Mask. And this just sounded like it would be great for my skin. It does have turmeric in it. Um, so again. Um, the IGK Mixed Feelings Leave-In Blonde Drops. This would be great for my hair. Um, you put it a little drop or two in a product and it'll tone it while, you know, like you're using it to style your hair or whatever. I've heard great things about that. It is available in my Sephora. So we'll see. But I've heard really great things about it. Um, the Laneige Kiss and Makeup Set. This is high on my list as well. Comes with a full size, which is $20 and three um, mini sizes and a little scooper so you can scoop it out. Um, a couple Philosophy Shower Gels are in here. Something else I'm really more and more interested in is the Buxom Party All Night Mini Lip Plumping Set. It has four of the lip creams for the lip, like sheerer lip glosses, plumping lip glosses, and four of the um, liners, the Buxom liners, for $49. And of course, they're all minis, and then it has some kind of little, I don't know, masquerade type mask, <laughs> which looks like it's um, actually... Like, tattooed like? I don't know. Not interested in using that ever, probably. <laughs> um, I did put two of these in here. I probably won't be able to get two, but it is a Philosophy Warm Caramel Cider Set um, of shower gels, and um, that is a definite. Also, the Candy Cane Shower Gel. Oh, and I guess that's it. <laughs> Did we really go through 26 items? Wow. So I'm going to have to kind of work my cart, see what I can and can't afford. Um, honestly, you know, I can tell you a few things I'm going to take out automatically. And one is going to be the Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. Then Natasha Denona um, Mini Blush and Glow. I'm having a hard time removing anything. Oops. Let's get back to, sorry about that. Probably even this, although I'd recommend this kit, probably this Charlotte Tilbury kit. I was looking at the re, um, reviews of those and um, a lot of people are complaining about the size. I know, you know, when I get that, that that's those are going to be minis. I get that. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, there's a few things I, you know, definitely am removing right away. Um, but the rest, you know, I still need to think about and whittle down dramatically. Um, but these are definitely items that I am thinking about. What are you thinking about? I would love to know that. Um, tell me what you are definitely buying, what you are thinking about buying, what you want to know about, whether you should buy or not. 
because I think a lot of us are there. Um, I always keep in the back of my mind, you know, it, this can be returned. Um, of course, you know, you are getting it at a discount, so now's the time to put the money out there. But, you know, you can return it, but also to make s- smart decisions because you won't get the discount when you respend that money. You know, if you are respending that money at Sephora, you're not going to get the 20% discount at a later time when you return it. So, you know, you've got that as well. So thank you so much. Um, Oh, you know what? I wanted to say that usually I use this um, to stock up on skincare. I kind of did that at Ulta. I bought um, a couple skincare items. Um, at their 20% off sale. And I will uh, do a... Oh, sorry about my dog. I will do a haul um, with that. It was fairly small. It was around the $100 mark for that. Um, but I got some good stuff. And, you know, are there any holiday sets like makeup or skincare or something that I really should be looking at right now? Um, because I would love to know that as well. So please comment below. Please subscribe if you can, um, if you're interested in my channel, because I do a lot of beauty hauls. I also do a lot of candle hauls, um, mainly Bath and Body Works, because I'm really interested and, uh, like the candles from Bath and Body Works. So thank you so much. Um, I greatly appreciate, um, everything here. Everybody's, especially when you comment, I really... I think that's the thing I like most about this is interacting with you. So if you wouldn't mind um, that. And again, I'm sorry about my little Leia. Let's see. There they are right there. So thank you so much. Really appreciate it. And we'll see you soon.